What's up, everybody? It's me, Odir, aka The Overview, and I would like to say, why don't we all just put a happy face? Because we've actually got our first picture for the Joker sequel, Joker 2, Filet a Deux. Madness of Two, if you want to translate it in English, but you know. We got our first picture of Joaquin Phoenix back in the saddle as Arthur Fleck, aka Joker, and from what I can tell of this picture right here, Nothing much, except there's a lot to analyze them within that one picture because one, we know is going to take place in Arkham Asylum because I can tell from the white coat and you see him getting his beard shaven, he still looks the same, like he hasn't gained any weight for the past couple years after being locked up for everything he did in the first movie. And what I want to say from this picture is that I don't even think that he's the Joker, the Joker yet, that it's been, a, um, what I know about this movie, it's been a couple years after the first one five years to be exact from release and i know that we're not going to get any batman in this movie this is basically going to be more of a musical which is kind of weird for me to say musical as in like musical musical but i don't know what to say other than this image that i know he's more of a broken man in this film because be honest if you think about it after the first movie he's not completely the joker yet he's given the, the moniker of the joker but he's not him yet he's not he doesn't have the smarts he doesn't have the planning he doesn't have the scheming he's just a regular guy who put on makeup and formed a rally which is basically every other white guy in america but yeah that's besides the point i want to say that for this movie what i'm expecting i'm not expecting too much out of this joker sequel since i know we're limited to just the joker-ish gotham characters because we know um harley quinn like played by lady gaga is gonna be in this film don't know if she's gonna go through the full transformation of harley quinn just like in suicide squad and in the regular harley quinn character herself i don't know if she's gonna be given the moniker of harley quinn where she's gonna have the the face makeup the the hair tips or maybe even the iconic costume suit but what i do want to see from this film is that it actually is more psychological more of the what makes a man crazier because we know that arthur fleck himself is more um he was more medicated, I want to say. I don't want to say he was crazy, crazy. He was more delusional. He took medications until he stopped taking them and actually started acting more confident how he saw himself. Because the first of this film is still up to interpretation. However you want to say what happened, happened. Whatever did happen, did happen. Whatever didn't happen, happened. But, you know, however you see the film is going to be way more developed in the sequel. What I do know is that we're still in its own separate universe. It's not connected to any film in the DC Cinematic Universe or the DCEU, from what I'm hearing, there's been a lot going on right there, but I'm going to stick to the Joker for right now. I am excited for this film. I know it's coming in 2024, which feels kind of ballsy to put up a picture. Knowing we're two years away from release, or a year and a half, if you want to say it from this trailer, or the date of the day we are, we are in right now, currently in December, but eh, I don't care. We're two years away. I can't wait for this film. I know it's going to be a, a lot more crazy than the first, since the first hit a billion dollars, and knowing that... Todd Phillips and Joaquin Phoenix can do whatever they want in this sequel. I know it has to be more action packed, not action packed to say, but more vamped. The violence has to go up because there has not been any other movie experience I've seen where everybody was freaked out and they had to put warning signs on the walls in the theater before you can go in, except Terrifier 2, but <laughs> that's a completely different thing. I just want to say I'm excited for this film. I know this one image shows him being treated at arkham but it has to be it something says that his time at arkham is gonna make him smart it's gonna make him logistical it's gonna make him the mastermind though not the joker as in the joker who go up against batman but more of the joker character building him up into his own if we're gonna get a third movie i hope we get a third movie to see how this whole cycle completes but i'm way too excited to see what's gonna happen next all right guys that's all for me talking about a photo see you guys in the next video like and subscribe because i haven't been saying that since I've been getting back into this channel thing. All right, guys, see you in the next video. Bye, guys.